I'm back up, back up, good and rude. Back again and I'm in the mood. Well, here we are, the two verse for Thursday afternoon. Sorry about wobbly, I'm trying to get the whole... There you go, isn't that much better, isn't it? Anyway, yeah. I'm standing here full of a bleeding cold, because you know what I'm like, I'm always snuffling and sniffling. Only I can get a cold at the end of bleeding August, the beginning of September. <gasps> I've got a throat like a cheese grater has been up and down it. I have food too, food. Yes, I have. I can't help myself. Yes. Anyway, so all that BS beside. Yeah. Um, I bought you these two. I did. I thought I'd give you a treat. It's little Nettie Noonoo, little Jeanette Archer. And Anarchy, her mate. Yes, yeah, she's got actually got a friend. Yes, her name is Anarchy. And she hails from Belgique. Belgique. She speaks Belgique or whatever it's called. Yeah, you know. And she's got herself over here on the ferry. And now she's come over to interview. <gasps> from all the way from Belgium. Yes, she has all the way. Interview Netty Nunu. Yes, so should we start it? I thought we should. Yes, right at the beginning. Here we go. Little Hovis boy. In his hobnail boots, you know, walking up the road with his hovis loaf of bread. Don't you remember it, Vutuvus? Do you? Don't you? No, nor do I. Anyway, come on. Oh, I've done that. Oh, dear. Gertie, come on. Snap to, you mad old mole. I can't help myself. I'm overexcited. This episode. Right. Of my podcast. Yes. Lucas, yes. Turn her up. I am still in the UK. Right. I am very, very happy. Yes. To interview this person. Okay. She's my friend. She seems really overcome with uh, unabounded, un her, undiluted happiness. Yes. Work with her already. Um, Come on. She organised the SRA conference. She did. It was such a resounding yes. Well, it was, was so successful. Event. Yes, it was. I believe an ex extremely important. Yes. Event. And. Um, no, it would be. I saw Jeanette when she money, money. first spoke out three years ago. Right. And immediately felt that this is a voice that will be heard oh, far and wide. God. And, you um, idiotic, so bleeding old malt. I... You idiotic, bleeding fruit loop. You're as bad as her. Birds of a feather flock together. Anyway, crack on, dear. Come on. I introduce her to you. Yes. I want to remind you that obviously I've come along. This way. is the most pertinent point. Um, we are sitting here. Uh... Very pertinent. You need to listen to this. You need to have both your ears pinned back and you need to be sat on the edge of your seat being agog. And you know what that feels like. Yes, she needs you to know she's come a very long way. She has. She costs her about 40 quid on the ferry. Might have even been 30. Do you know what I mean? A lot of money. And uh, she's got a camera, something or other, that now she's going to regale us with. Yes, she is. She could have got over here for free if she'd just gone down on the beach in Normandy. Yeah, and got on the inflatable. Mind you, she'd probably bore them all to death, this old thing, wouldn't she? They'd probably, they'd probably push her out and say, no, you can walk, dear. Come on. Well, we're not recording this on my iPhone. Yes. Uh, Lee, thank you very much. Yes, her boyfriend, uh, no doubt. Have, um, professional help. And, of course, this is coming out of my own. It's, she should get on to Anna Breeze, shouldn't she? She should. Because if you go to one of Anna Breeze's seminars, she will learn you stuff like how to hold your phone. She will. How to swivel it around and do a selfie. You know, how to film something and upload it on social media on your phone. She will. Might have to give us some dosh, though, because she's a bit like you. You know what I mean? Money. E-begging. Yes, give me money for something completely inane that you could actually do for free. My iPhone. Yes. Uh, Lee, thank you very much. Lee's a Lee, 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 Lee. Lee, Lee. Have, um, professional help. Yes, you need and professional of help. It's, it's coming out of my own pocket. Is it? So I know that um, donations have come in. I'm very grateful. Yes, uh, not enough. Not nearly beginning to cover what I've spent. Uh, <laughs> I didn't think it would love. No, I really had to die. I must be mystic. <laughs> uh, uh, it's possible. Right. But um, if you can donate, yes. uh, I would very much appreciate yes. if you find the donate button. Yes. In the description. Uh, is it near the off button, dear? On my website. Shall I just press so, the off button? Um, without further ado, oh. I want to begin this conversation right. with my friend Jeanette Archer. Oh, hello, Nettie. Hello. I'm so excited. Hello, Nettie. Hello. <laughs> hello, darling. You are girl? I'm just so... Oh, hello. Straight off the bat, I've got a problem. I've got a problem, teacher. Not being funny, Nettie. When you're never going to see 55 again, it's best to have a... 
you know, a slightly higher top. Yes, a saggy decolletage. It does nobody any favours. Yes, especially when you couple it with a granny cardigan uh, and you've got your hair all sort of around your, your face, Meghan Markle styling. I think my, my sons used to call women like you 1666ers, dear. Yes, 16 from behind and 66 when they turn round, dear. You know, that's what men think. When you get past a certain age, it's more becoming just to pin your hair up. You do lots of lovely styles. I'm sure there's beautiful women out, out, out there, 55 and over with long hair. You know, fair play to them, do what you want. But this thing, she ain't one of them. Together and, um, Come on, girlfriend. It was so good to meet you. Mm? I have to tell everybody yes. how loving you are. Oh, oh, I was you oh, giving out my bank details and everything. I like that. I'm very loving it. I'm like a, kid. I'm like a sex kitten. Yes, I am. <laughs> because we know. Ah. I know your fierce side. Right. Um, it is, you know, I get the chills. You're we a all, very powerful person. We all get the chills when that this thing starts yabbing, dear, but powerful, mm, you know what I mean? Not really. I love Divvy. Divvy. Yes. And I love how you make people hear you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you stroke mine and I'll stroke yours, darling. Yes, so I will. Should we get them out? <laughs> oh, she's so powerful. <laughs> That's the idea. Yeah, it is. Give me your yes. money. Um, so Cut to the quick. Those who may not know you. Um... Have I took too much of her cold medication or are these two off their bleed barnets? You look at their eyes, they both seem somewhat out of it. Would you Mind you, that's Nettie's uh, default setting, isn't it? Uh, out of it, dear. Shorter, or as long as you would like. Yeah. What happened to you in childhood? What happened to you? Oh, don't ask. Yes, absolutely. That, that you know, you're going to regret asking that, Anniki. You really are. What happened to you in your childhood? Oh, my God. Right, hold on tight for a super fast, full of BS ride. But thank you for that. Thank you for asking me because really I can be happy on. I'll flap my jaws, I can. I'll flap my jaws. The warrior that's trying to expose. Warrior coming to get you. Get your checkbook out. I got me begging bowl. Warriors. This um, evil. Yes. It's generally, what people see in the public domain. Yeah, but, little um, dumpy old women. You no, know, it's nice when people actually do get to meet me in person and yeah. see that I'm, I'm a nice person. You yeah. prick. Shut <laughs> up. Very nice. Yes. It's not, it's <laughs> so thank you for that. Uh, uh, yes, so. I if being a Pratt was an Olympic event, she'd have gold every time, love. She really would, but you're just as weak and watery and dappy as her. A... I mean, you know, we're both we're both never going to see 55 again, but we're going to sit here and be as depressing as we possibly can on every social media platform. We are, we're going to say the worst, most disgusting things to make you pity us so you give us some money. Yes, yes, yes. So I'll buy some more puff and have a chuckle with the old bifter. Yes, me and my new mate, Anarchy. We're a multi-generational... Multi-millionaire, no. Family. Right. As far as I know, yes. my whole family were part of this time. So can I stop you there? Because you said as far as you know. So that would lead me to the conclusion that maybe you don't know. Or do you know? I don't know. I don't know whether you know. None of us do. None of us know anything, Jeanette, but we feel like you're going to illuminate us. Cult, yes. There's a cult. Parents, Where's the cult? Oh, there. Grandparents on yes. both sides. Right. Uncles, aunts, aunties, yeah. The children. Their children. Um, None yeah, of them speak to you, can't think why. Everybody Such a ray of sunshine. A it's a, a force for good. The satanic cult. Right. And it was multi generational. Sat Nicks, dear, Sat Nicks. She's definitely had a bifta. Look at them opioid eyes. Oh, not that you have opioid eyes when you have a bifta, but you've got to factor in this thing. Sure. Can it um, stop already, you nonsense. Birth to three years of age. Right, one to three. In the home you were being prepared. For the rituals that I would in the home. Were you a chicken dinner? Yes. And then from yes. age Trust three, you up, roasted you over a spit were, roast to um, tell something no one cares about. My family, that was the age where we were then handed over. Yes. To the cult you remember that? And or Free. sold into yes. other smaller cults, cults. cults. Um, for the sake of my parents earning money. Right. Um, well, that would make so perfect sense, dear. I prostituted for You were, because there's no such yeah. thing as child prostitution. I've said it a million times before, and I'm going to keep on saying it. 
Stop using emotive language. You were not, and there is no such thing. You and John Wedger are both criminals the way you say that. No such thing as child prostitution. It's a child exploitation. Children cannot consent to be that word. No more than they can consent to drive a taxi. Now, come on. Get a grip, Jeanette. You're losing your head. Mind you, to be honest, it's a spiel. She's got a big bowl out, isn't she? Come on, girlfriend. Hello, Look at old Andy Key. Look, I'm really here. Um, I'm present so for this. I am. There's a cockroach on the table. Look. This is running away. Help. Help. Get me help. One of them's going to lick their finger and pick it up and eat it, aren't they? They just are. They are. For Cockroach, here we go. The and the and you spent one of them. Um, <laughs> tongues to whip out. <laughs> no more cockroaches. All of everything that goes with being, you know, a victim in a satanic cult. Yeah, she's victim. And we're all victims, dear. Into well, we are now. Cult, you know, which was the, yes. Um, what I now recognise to be the um, God. Elites Please hurry up! Of this world. Things um, to do, places to go, family. people to see. Gosh! Enduring right. ritual after ritual. And yes. Probably <clears throat> thousands of rapes by hundreds of people. She seems as bored with her story as what we are of hearing it, doesn't she? Oh, uh, what's her name? Stupid here. Netty New News. She was in the car or summit. Rituals with people. Yeah. Um, yeah, I was really also happened. trained as an MK Ultra. She was, she was trained as an MK. I was trained as an MK Ultra, super soldier, or something or other, whatever to bear. <laughs> Little dumpy me, because trust me, I've seen. You know how most of us, when we were younger, we were quite pretty and thin, nice figures and everything. You know, well, this wasn't. Do you know, she was just. Dumpy and rotund. Yeah, I've seen photos, honestly. Obviously. They're the sort of pictures you can put up on your fireplace to keep the kids away from the uh, hearth. Yes, yes. Come on, Jeanette, for crying out blue blazes, dear. So maybe that's where the fierceness comes from. <laughs> yes, it does. Um, it's just so fierce. <laughs> I'm scared of you already, Jeanette. <laughs> well, where are we, folks? Are we enjoying this pity party? Is it a laugh a minute? Are we peeing ourselves with laughter? Come on, dear. And yeah, and the K, I and the K. Who I was regularly at the Tavistock with. She here was. In she was regularly at um, Tavistock. In here in the UK. Something or other. Yeah. Yes. So I think yes. really my main right. MK Ultra, the Super Soldier side, where yes. I used to. Oh in. yeah, that that stupid bleeding conference thing wasn't a conference. It was just an ego massaging, massaging seminar for Jeanette to benefit from it's just hilariously awful uh yeah in that she shares with us that not only was she an mk ultra super soldier or summit but she was also taken underground and she was abused by the dr 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 reptilians dr dr dracos or something or other that literally no one believes Jeanette except you dear <laughs> she was taken underground and abused by the aliens or something or other <laughs> Yes, she was. It really happened. Out there. Of yes. Is, right. Um, was probably more the second decade of my life. Yes. I was still being used. That far back, dear? In rituals. Was in it? Those years. Post war Britain. Um, from yes. What my memories yes. have allowed me to see so far. Uh, I believe. Raging narcissism I off the scale. Got out. Yes. 22. 22, yes. All the twos, 22, netty new. It's a summary, really. Yes. Wow. So not that summary. Yes, oh, that's sort of summary, sorry. I thought you meant your you know, personality. Uh, say it's more autumnal, dear. Speak very well. Um, she doesn't, you know, Nikki. Stop blowing is, smoke up her being considerably so large hiney. Yeah. Oh, I'm devastated. Yeah. That little girl, that little girl. I got a head cold and I got a sore throat. And my ears hurt and I don't feel that good, Anarchy, you know, summit or other. I was an MK Ultra, summit or other. That's all I just want to say. I'm Mind so control. <laughs> no one could control that abyss. No one would even go there, do you get me? <laughs> Are we going to do mind control on Jeanette Felcher? We can. We don't care. <laughs> We're going to do it. <laughs> She's a super bleeding soldier. She is. <laughs> 
She's powerful warrior. And I think if I focused right. on the enormity yes. of the trauma of, every oh, of your lies, dear. About it, yes. I wouldn't be able to do what I do. No, you wouldn't. That's no, no, you I definitely wouldn't. No, but you, you force yourself on, don't you, dear? You, <laughs> you flagellate yourself forwards, don't you? Yes, you prostrate yourself at our very feet. All in the name of Luca. I don't think she's well into it because she knows that the begging's going to anarchy. Because she's giving anarchy here, this thing, this old bin here. She's the one taking me donations for me podcast or something. I've had to come from Belgium, which is like 12 miles across the sea on the ferry. I'd be further to go to Scotland, wouldn't it? You know what I mean? But whatever. Uh, so Jeanette's sort of like half-heartedly. Either that or they've both had a bifter. I just can't make it out. But she's not a full... Full frog. I think she's got such a lot of narcissistic supply on the back of that um, conference that she was obviously centre of attention, you know. It was all about Jeanette. Yes, every last bit. She was taken underground and abused by the reptilians. She was food to the stop it. Cheers. I can hear you all laughing and you're just mean. Well, you know, like Jeanette would lie. Us. Jeanette Felcher. We she's aren't very... able to speak about oh, no, I wish she without didn't. going into the feeling all the time. Yeah, we don't. just the truth. We just say what it is. Yes. Because we've all felt, Bullshit. felt everything. Is it? Yes. And I think as well. Right. I know you've spent many years <sighs> in England and recovery Come yourself. And I need. The same I need therapy me, food I too. To shut myself away I need some therapy. Years, I'm suffering uh, now and I. Before I even considered uh, speaking out publicly. <sighs> so I think. The Victorians used to call women like her drabs. And I think how very apt. That obviously Drab. laid a very strong foundation for me. Well, that bullshit is, you know. Either, either. Come on, dear. Now. Hurry up, I've got a life to live. Yes. Jesus really Christ. Decades, they're really necessary. Yes. Not for everyone. Because Don't know. Times are changing. Tell me. Yes. And, um, yes. People are healing. <laughs> They're healing. Yeah. I'm healing. I'm healing. I'm healing. I am. I'm well healed. Yeah, well, you will be when you've got all these people of their money. Yes, healed indeed. Healed to the very brim. Um, I didn't find anyone who knew this. No. And so my therapist didn't actually know. No. Yes, I... I pity yes, your I therapist. Know. I really do. I, I bet know, your therapist... Do... Just dear, I'm talking now. Do you mind? You're in my laptop. Yes. I bet your therapist needed bleeding therapy after having to put up with you pair of bleeding wizards. Amazing. Oh, therapist. look at us. Yes. yes. But I feel a little the first way of sunshine. For them to be able to help yes. me with satanic witch abuse. Something in the way she moves. Moves me like no other mother. Days, I didn't even know it had a name. Something in the way um, she bullshits. And, um, you know we believe you now. To to you know we believe you now. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. We're missing the laugh. Stop, through two. Stop. She's made a joke. Now we should all politely laugh. You know, this, <laughs> you do, you do. Do, 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 do
yeah. and step down right. and not feel like she has to be that person because... <sighs> You're talking about you, dear. There isn't any other person apart from you, my dear. Yes, this is the road to madness, thinking that you've got lots of people living inside you. You really haven't, you know? I bet you, knowing our luck, if she did have a load of people living inside her, they'd all be as boring as her, wouldn't they? Hey, <laughs> what do you reckon? <laughs> Actually, oh. those abilities yes. that she has and on. used yes. and used for, yes. I have them anyway. Oh, so, well, she would do, wouldn't she, Vutu first? Do you know what I mean? So she's got all these people inside her what have got special abilities. But she didn't really need them because she had all these superpower things herself, whatever, summit or other. She had verbal diarrhoea, yes. She was veritably <laughs> comatose with diarrhoea, you know. You know, Jeanette, the front person. The front, I yes, I agree with that. my parts now. Oh, front, sorry. Oh, yes, you've got loads of front, my dear. Yes, yes, won't find many people with as much front as you, dear. Relax. Most of it's Step sagging down. on my screen and at the moment. Do you mind, dear? To be the, the super soldier. Cover up the blinkly. Slave, you know, that so on and so on and so on. Super um, soldier sex slap, slap. That's an alliteration. I can't be doing that. No, not with my false teeth. You know, the, the child held in captivity. And yeah. The, the, the child that was the pleaser for everybody. Right. So many different roles. Yes. So. Egg, I like egg mayonnaise. This is why personally. I think when a bit of ham mustard roll. I love it. Off the hook, I like so the crispy speak. roll. They oh, sorry. Be that role anymore. No, no, it you wouldn't be because you'd eat it, my dear. You've only got to look at yourself, dear. And then... Don't you start competing with me, eh? Took me years and a lot of money to get as beautiful and bountiful, or whatever the word is, blocked split. What do they call it? Buxom. Yeah, it's bullshit. I'm fat. It Come on. Can bring the front person, you know, so much more inner peace oh. and quiet and... Old Anarchy, she's proper getting off on it, isn't she? really <laughs> then start to <laughs> rest. Yes! And not feel exhausted every time. Oh, yeah, I'm exhausted listening to your bullshit. Yeah, shut up, love. Like, Do me nothing now. <laughs> come know, on, get on to the... Where... Rest now. Yeah, so come I on. I think calm, connected... Um, compassionate, curious. Co 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 I immediately get that distance. Right. I take a few deep breaths. Yes. And I just, you know, it doesn't always work. Think more bullshit. It's so <laughs> weak and watery. I'm sorry. Personally, women like her, I can't be dealing with. Well, women like neither of them, but this one particularly, her on the left, she's so affected. You know, you can imagine being around her. You'd be on Prozac by the end of the day, wouldn't you? Come on, dearie. <laughs> Like, well, no, I need to be in control here. And, you know, yeah, sometimes... We it's know that, my dear, we know that. ...to keep worrying about all their needs, but... She's what? talking about all the needs of the various personalities that she carries inside her maniacal musings. I like about curiosity as well is... Curiosity killed the bleeding cats, apparently. Hearts, Bloody good group they were as well. to be curious too. And I have to find the compassion to allow that. Right. Especially the smaller ones. Mm. You know, so mm. I got struggled with allowing... Is she a Russian doll? Is that what she's on about? That you take one off and there's another inside and another inside and another inside and another inside ad infinitum? Because obviously it would be... It's Nettie we're talking about. She's super duper. So she's not just going to have eight or ten, is she? She's going to have like hundreds. Yeah. Yes, she is. They're all living inside her. Them to be curious. <sighs> Oh my God. Then to have the time. Please let me go. Please, I beg. Beg and you. Learn and Please hurry questions. up. So the curious yes. part for me is... Is, is, very is curiouser and curiouser, yes. Come on, Draco. For me and then. Yes. No, She's had that. intercourse with Super Dracos soldier. and some other reptilians. reptilians. Super soldier. I was trained physically. Yes. Because I had to be healthy. Yeah. And I had to be in good shape and I had yeah. to be flexible. Oh, yeah. Belgium is kind of. So, in fairness to her, I don't know enough about her, but Belgium is replete with um, the P word people that with far bit on the end. Yeah. Have a monstrous problem with it. But then I don't think. I think probably it's the same as every other country nowadays, to be honest. It's a mixed up, muddled up, shook up world when it comes to the P word. Yes, the file people, the minor attracted people, those people that go around bothering minors. Yes, yes. That's why Mackie shut down all the coal mines, wasn't it? Don't blame her. I was trained physically. Right. Um, and I'm still doing You it. look trained physically. I keep doing it. Uh, as I a sort of... Yoga, but now for your own wretch. 
only for me. It's my health insurance. It keeps me yes. to do yoga every day. Oh, oh, well, here we go. Oh, now, now we're here. Now we're here. It does yoga every day, so I rest my case. It's one of them. Oh, God, let's carry on listening to these pair of joyous individuals. These morbid, boring, dreary, drab, ghastly. I can't think of any more adjectives, so we're back to, back to her. Come on. Go on, Anarchy. It's a very powerful force. Oh, shut up. Go on, yeah. Jeanette. And before I even recognised yes. my MK Super Soldier training. It is I, a new newest thing. I think it's only recently she's recognised um, MK Ultra Super Soldier Summit other and the Draco Reptilian Summit. She was on a royal estate where they did uh, summit ritual abuse. Because, I mean, if she was just abused as a kid, I mean, there's not a lot of currency in that, is there? It's a bit boring. So, you know, she is the phantasmagorical abuse survivor victim. She is. So any of you that are sat at home and you think, well, I don't know, I was traumatised in my childhood. But I guess I've got nothing to moan about, really, because, hey, there's nothing new, new. And every new memory, it's a new compo claim, isn't it? Yeah, because you don't have to prove it. Just fill in the forms. Come on, Nettie. I had this very strong trait as a protector. You did. Whether it be my friends yeah, or... Yeah, well, you're not you protecting know, us with your BS, are you? I, I was... I can't. I can't. It was just one of my most dominant... Yeah. ...characteristics, you know. Yeah, it was the dominant These characteristic. It's full of BS and Vile, fibbing. disgusting creatures. And they were laughing at what the children were going through. Right. On the, um, you know, the sacrificing... Yes. The, you know, the mutilation, the raping, the drinking, the blood, and, and they were getting high on adrenochrome. And right. it was oh. one of the things that I always... To start with, adrenochrome is a serum that's removed from the pituitary gland. It's not in the blood, you moron, but whatever. Yes, go on. Despite like so deep I know that feeling I know that feeling we're on the same wavelength now dear and these squealing noises they'd start to make and so mm. on and so forth so yes. this was happening this day right I just the rage just kept coming and coming right and I was an observer at this ritual yes little dumpy old Jeanette so yes. that tells me by now <sighs> I wasn't actually being tortured and raped in the ritual. I was being made to observe the ritual. I feel I'm being tortured and my mind is being raped right now having to listen to your BS. But do, do, do. Oh, dear, do. Go on. Dear. And I just remember <sighs> seeing all this laughter. Yeah. Oh, we can't have that. Can't have people laughing, can you? Something in me. No attention. Took over. Yeah. Obviously, it was the assassin. Right. And I... She's been playing Assassin's Creed on the computer. She's an MK Ultra Super Soldier. She's now an assassin. She's been under the ground and she's been consorting in an intercourseal type of way with Draco Reptilians or Summit or Bleeding Other. Carry on. All I remember yes. was the rage. You seem to remember a lot for somebody that starts a sentence by saying all I remember. Because when you say all I remember, it gives me the heads up that luckily you don't remember a lot and you're going to shut the flip up. But no, go on, dear. All you remember is quite a lot, isn't it? And then I remember the aftermath. You remember the aftermath, yes. And the aftermath was, yeah, a I think bath, a bloodbath of, blood of them. A, a bloodbath blood of them. created. Exactly. And yeah. I think yes. I left probably three of them standing. Right. So she performed a bloodbath on these satanic what's it or other. And because she was super and a soldier and something or other, she did that and only three of them were left standing at the end because, hey, little dumpy Jeanette, she's like Wonder Woman. Yes. And they were cowering then, begging me. More like the bleeding joker, you nutter. Not. Go so. on! I guess I shouldn't be laughing. Got potatoes to peel. But um, I wish I could have seen that. Yeah, I think we all of course. do. Why wouldn't you feel that? You know? Yes. What justice have we ever had yeah. in that respect? And, and exactly. those are moments. Exactly. You know? Exactly. When um, it's turned on them because yeah. those children 
yes, God, so I can't. I just can't. Please and stop, stop. Well, was that the police would come to my house. Right. Lived, yeah, twist um, you up, just put you in Rampton. And my mother would have me dressed and ready to go. Oh, right. And open the door and they would take me off. Right. And to the cells. The, the police. The police. Yeah, in uniform. Put you in the cells. They would quite often rape me in the car before I was even delivered. Right. To now, that's quite... The Royal Estates. That's... And that was when I was... Shush. At places like Windsor. Right, stop. Now, just stop there. Because now you're making quite a big accusation. You're blaming the police for picking you up and doing disgusting things with you in the car and then delivering you off to Windsor Castle. That creature. Go on, you menace. Come on. Castle and Buckingham Palace. And, yes. Um, the Royal, the bigger Royal Estates big. with hunting games and everything like that went on. Ah, uh, the bigger Royal Estates. Can't quite remember their names. We don't mean Balmoral by any chance. Actually, he seems to have land akin to most uh, British counties. Yes? Yes? Is it? Is it Balmoral? Or could it be Sandringham where it's ditto? Half of Norfolk is believed uh, owned by the Queen in the thing of Sandringham, is it? I think it was bought by Edward VII, Queen Victoria's oldest son, and he was Prince of Wales. Been in the family ever since. Hunting, shooting, fishing. Yes, but to her... It was like she's watched the Hunger Games or something, so she's proper on one. So now she's running around the Royal Estates while they're hunting her barefoot. And then she's getting done over by the reptilians. But hey, she's a super soldier. Yes, yeah, so they've controlled her mind, apparently. And those police that are then, of course, involved in that. Right. They themselves involved in rapists and compromise. Uh, yes. Become <sighs> the protectors then. <sighs> Because that's yes. how nobody ever gets charged, and no. you know, to this day now. Well, they're not going to, dear, because you're full of BS and you talk hooey. You're just like getting on the computer and you've got no personality beyond, look at me, I'm a victim. Feel sorry for me, I'm a victim, or something or other. So I was still living in my family right. world. Were you? Um, so I think I just carried on that way. Yes. And then through, from really then, from 22, for right. the, next, the coming years, right. I just got ill and ill. Yes, you know, yes, more I, more concur. More. I concur, I concur. Yeah, that definitely nice. happened. You are very ill. And You're then sick in the head. 28, I remember just sitting there going, OK, what, what's wrong with me? And talking right. to whoever, you know. Yeah. I'll tell you, stop stop you right there. What's wrong with you is you're a chocker block brimful of B bleeding S. That's your problem, dear. You need to go and, well, derobe yourself of your BS um, in whatever way you fancy. You've got to show me because I knew there was, was something. Hiding stuff you were hiding. Myself, and I just. I mean, you're not hiding up. it now, are you? I can see it flopping all over the show place. Me or I'm leaving. I'm right. coming home. Right. Because I. I know what's there, you know, from all my near-death experiences and... Oh, I'm having so one now, so I'm having one now. Body experiences. I'm having an out-of-body you know, experience. It's like, a big body to be out of, dear. A wonderful day, you know. Yes. <laughs> no, no, my God, no. <laughs> <laughs> that bit I'm going to spin on because I think it's disgusting to even suggest something like that on social media, especially when she has very weak-minded and... Uh, um, disturbed minds that actually follow her and it's not the first time she'd been uh, talking about suicide in an ideation uh, type of way and somebody did actually um, either attempt or commit one of her followers yeah and I've seen the text messages she sent as well telling them how to tie the knot and everything she's just a bleak menace she's an absolute a-hole of the first finest order and that's all she is reptilian draco bleed nonsense and she's got a rope pull the royal family and they can't defend themselves either she can just go on every media platform and just talk the biggest load of smack about people that can't defend themselves against her nonsense you're just so full of it you really are go on dear for days so uh, that's how she stayed that is that figure in my head yeah yes so, yeah, but it was age 28 when I started to recover the memories. I started yes. to speak out to my family. Right. I was given the ultimatum. Yes. Shut up. Right. Or you're out. 
Yeah, they probably thought you were crazy, that. love. Cut them all out. Yeah, well, somewhere in it, she said she was up at the Tavistock Institute. She was abused up there as well. Like, in another interview, she said Claus Schwab used to abuse her at the Tavistock Institute, which is part of uh, some hospital in London uh, that does reassignment surgery nowadays. And I don't know what he was doing in her days. It's supposed to be something to do with something that no one believes. Uh, yes, then she was at the Hospital of Nervous Disorders and because she had some mental bleeding well you can imagine can't you you've heard her uh well i looked into that that's a load of bs and hooey yeah um uh, nervous disorders was to do with paralysis people that had strokes and the study of people with um epilepsy because obviously in the victorian times i didn't understand these things and it then morphed into the neurosurgical and neuro pathological so in other words the working of how your brain works um it's particularly renowned this uh hospital now it's called something different now and it's part of the london national health trust obviously nowadays uh but it's uh, it works with people that have brain cancer so um working out what part of your brains operate what part of your body and to be honest no one would send her there if she presented to a doctor back when she was 28 Right. The GP just would have filled her up with some Valium or some Prozac or whatever. Wouldn't have sent her there because she's just a melt and full of BS. And to be honest, I've had enough. Well, I'm sure you've had enough. It does go on in the same vein. If you really want to catch it on there and, you know, you want to flagellate yourself. To... She's just so sick and twisted. Should we just do a little bit more? See what else she comes out with. Come on, dear. I'm wonderful, I'm lovely. Every survivor that starts to break their silence and heal, start their healing journey yeah. in whatever way that is you need to. Do you mind doing your healing journey on your own in private, dear? Does it have to be across every social media forum where you talk dirty and do auditory things for people that are, well, dispossessed, dissolute, and disturbed, dis, 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 just dis. For them. This, we, this, this. Our light just joins up. Right. It just gets bigger and Does brighter it? Right. and stronger. Yes. And this is why their darkness. Yes, yeah, she took a trip, dear. She took a trip. So yes. this is all it takes. Either that. If you imagine... Well, she's back in the 90s and she's had a couple of doves. Yes. She's going to start dancing at any moment to the traffic signal. She is beep, 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 beep at the pedestrian crossing. She is. They come and twist her up. Put her away somewhere with any luck. Uh, not that she was ever, you know, you can't ever imagine her dancing and going anywhere. But, you know, she's probably just at home, boring everyone around her with, I'm a victim. Give me all your narcissistic supply. If I need D, I need attention. Yeah, I was a dumpy, ugly, plain little thing when I was young. Didn't get no men attention. But now, guess what? I'm getting lots of attention. I am. I can't help myself. It would be over for them. Oh. They would have nowhere left to Who's operate. They? Who's they? they depend on silence. But surely the they's that were abusing you back in 1940 or whenever it was you were a kid, dear, wouldn't they be they, they, they? Aren't they long dead? Because who is they? We don't know who they are. Oh, I know. They're the people that live in your head, aren't they? Go on. That is their strongest weapon. Yes, it is. Exposure is their greatest fear. Right. So as long as we keep doing this... Yes. We're... Please click the donate and donate this old bin some money. Yes, just give her enough money, bus fare, so she can get down and get some valleys. Do you get me, Capiche? Shut her up. Anyway, just ignore her. If I can, I'll put the um, phone number for the Survivors Network up on this um, thing because you can get hold of the Survivors Network if you. And listen, if you're abused as a kid and you're listening to this crap and it's diminishing what you went through, right? Just ignore her. She's full of BS. Everybody what is it's subjective to the person. It affects people in different ways. And I know people that were abused terribly and traumatised as children. And it was nothing to do with sex. And it affected them for the rest of their lives. A lot of autoimmune diseases uh, nowadays are put directly down to uh, childhood abuse, uh, childhood trauma, uh, something that traumatises a kid. Obviously, when you've got a little kid whose body is just growing and learning how to work and all this, that and the other... Yeah, I can really see how autoimmune diseases can actually 
have the uh, the uh, the genesis in childhood trauma. I can, um, but don't let anybody. If you are listening to this, thinking, "Wow, you know, I had a weird uncle that made whatever," you know, it's subjective to you. Yeah, she's just full of BS. None of this happened. She's an absolute melt. She's out there just to try and like shock jock isn't she don't listen to anybody that's really been abused just listen to Nettie no no yes yes bye bye now